All right, we're about to make some exciting water. Water can get a little boring for some people, even though it's probably the healthiest thing, and we are 70% water, so we need to be really conscious of drinking enough water every day. So what are some ways that we can make water interesting? Well, one thing we can do is, it, they're called infusions, and we can add vegetables or fruits or spices into the water in little parts just to kind of wake up or tantalize the taste buds. So for example, cucumbers. Now cucumbers are, are really an easy one. And you see how um, sometimes we would peel them, but for visual effect, I just took a fork and went down like this so it's a little more interesting. And you can just put a bunch of those in the water. And I don't know, it's on a really hot day. There's something really special about cucumber. I don't, I don't know what it is. I don't know that it's particularly alkalizing. Well, it is. Um, but it's very refreshing. It, and so as this, this will sink as time goes by. Now I'm going to take you out to my garden and show you how you can use mint and things from your garden. Come with me. Right, this is from going between my kitchen to my backyard. And you'll see I have lots of light and lots of plants. And I have here growing uh, two kinds of peppers, habanero and jalapeno. And I have a zucchini plant going here. And then come with me outside to the, to the herb garden. You'll see Mr. Chauncey on the way. He adorns everything. You'll see my big, big fig tree. Let's go this way. And looky here. We have a row of, of earth boxes that are full of herbs. So um, here we have oh, got three kinds of oregano. Check out the parsley. Lots of parsley. I have my kale. I have three kinds of kale. I have Swiss chard and um, lots, again, of parsley. But look at this mint. Is that not fabulous? Let me just take this one. It's in my backyard. It can be in your backyard, too. Or it can be in planters on your windowsill. You can have this all year round. So now I've been to the garden and I've captured my mint. And now we're just going to take a lot of mint leaves and put them in the water. You could add lemon with this. You could add oranges with it. Anytime when you think that mint is a nice flavor, think what went with it and add that to the infusion. So, um, you see this at hotels a lot these days. They've got amazing combinations of fruits and, and herbs. So again, this will sink to the bottom as it's been here for a while <coughs> and gives a subtle flavor of mint. So there we, that's another way that you can have a little more interesting water. Now we're still thinking about water and what would taste good in water? First of all, use really good water to start with. I have a water filtration system in my house, which I would recommend whether you have one at your sink or whether you have a whole house one, but we are at least 70% water, so it makes, we want to keep that water part of us really healthy and not full of toxins. So I'm thinking about teas now that are good combinations of flavors. And when people get a little sick or they have a cold, a lemon ginger tea is really good. So you could make that for yourself hot or cold. So if you, I have fresh ginger here, which you can buy at any grocery store. And I'm just gonna take it, slice it kind of thin. I'm just gonna put that in the water along with lemon. I bet it's gonna be good too. And you know, washing the lemons is, is one, Lemons can be so contaminated when we think about washing our vegetables and fruit. Lemons get handled so much if you're out in a restaurant. So make sure that you wash your lemons really well before you um, do anything else with them. So there I have ginger and lemon. Could be a, it could be warm as a tea or cold as a refreshing beverage. Okay, that's another idea. Here's a tasty little infusion 
that will make your water feel exciting rather than boring. So I simply, you, again, use your imagination, but right here I have mandarin oranges, and I have a cinnamon stick, I have fresh rosemary from the garden, and um, that's it. So I'm just gonna take a lot of this rosemary. Oh, rosemary smells so good. And mandarin orange. And if I were serving this in an individual container, I could, um, this will look pretty with it. Oh, I'm not sure I get some orange in there. There you go. And then I could stick my cinnamon in there like that. Kind of pretty, not exactly a tropical drink, but actually from here it does look like a, a, a tree. So there you have a really nice, not boring way of drinking water when it's really warm outside or all year round.